Hey everyone, I wanted to just do a short, really quick um, update on your rough drafts because I've had in the past uh, other times I've taught this class there's been a little bit of confusion so I just want to make sure there's none. Basically, what to do at the end of this week, Sunday at 11.59 p.m., week 8, is uh, like a third of, the, of your paper and it needs to be as complete as possible. Um, it's a rough draft. Uh, what you turn in, then I'm going to spend significant time with on Monday and Tuesday next week. Editing, uh, giving you advice, comments. Basically, it's like a dry run for you to turn in your paper. Then you get back my comments and all of that, and then you get another, what, two, three weeks? Two, or two weeks? Two weeks to um, finish it up, make it ship shape, and turn it in for your final paper. After that, you know, I'll grade it and you get your class grade. Now, in the past, I've had students turn in a complete 2,500 word paper um, at the end of rough draft week. And you are welcome to do that. As much as you want to write, I will grade. This is a huge benefit to you because you can literally write your paper, turn it in. I'll even give you the grade you'd receive. So you turn in, you turn a paper and I say, this is this. I have all these comments, I have all these changes I've made, and at the bottom I say 92% is what this is what this paper gets. Not only that, I'll even tell you, with the 92% of this paper, this is the grade you get in this class. And if that grade is to your liking, you don't have to do anything else. You're done with your final project. So it is hugely beneficial to you to write as much as you can, do the best that you can, and turn it all in. Because what if, you know, at the bottom it'll say something like, this paper right here is a 65. You need, if, if this paper were turned in as is today, you would not, you'd get less, you'd get a 78 in the class, you'd not get a B minus, you would not be able to continue at Fuller. But, because you've written all this, and because I've edited it, and changed it, and shown that this, 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 and this, and all this needs to be changed, you're able to move forward with your, your, uh, your draft, and when you turn in your final paper, you're ready to you know, make it happen. So I would highly, highly encourage everybody to turn in a full torn paper at the end of this week. That said, you don't have to. But if you do, you could potentially be done with the class on Sunday. I mean, I think there's maybe like a form that you have to, to do to you know, finish it out. But you'd basically be done. All major work behind you. Or, alternatively, you'd see how far you have to go in order to, you know, take what you have and get it to graduate level. This class is passed. So it is 100% to your benefit to do as much as you can. As you're doing a rough draft, um, make sure you at least hit the requirement. And if you have the time and you have the inclination, here's your chance to have a free dry run at the final project. That I will res respond with all the information that you need to know where you are and where you're going to go. So that's my offer. Take it or leave it.